Hey, 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 Gemini, this is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your reading. So this is going to be a reading for my Geminian Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Gemini, if you would before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs. Information can be found in the description box below. Make sure that you're utilizing that link in the description box, Gemini, if you are interested as there are scammers about the community and know that you will always see my face in a reading if you order one from me as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. Gemini, your overall energy is the Seven of Wands here. You have the Lovers, your card, Four of Moons, which is Cups, the Queen of Stars, which are Pentacles, and the King, sorry, the Knight of Wands. Ooh. Okay, <laughs> Gemini, you have some options coming towards you. I feel like there are even more than two options here. But I don't know if you're necessarily happy with these options. That's what I'm getting. One of them, well, one of them could be a player or they could just be younger. But with the four of moons here, I'm getting this, nah, you're not really looking at the options. Let's see what's going on. Tell me about the Seven of Wands. And my left ear is ringing. So pay attention to your feminine energy. Connect to your intuition here. As I say that, the Four of Swords comes out. Strength card. And the Four of Stars. You may really have stability on your mind right now. Because you've got three fours here. All right, I'm hearing angelic guidance. So you are being guided angelically here. You are very much guarded when it comes to love. You're trying to remain strong, but I feel like the strength is here because of your focus on stability. You could be worried about your stability. Hmm. Interesting energy because I feel this love coming at you from this direction but you're looking over there because you're like, yeah, no, that's not what I wanted. I, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I want. But you're not quite giving it your attention or giving them your attention. Yeah, see? Despair. You're not looking up. Can I have one more here? Mm, coffin. So <laughs> this energy needs to be lifted. This energy needs to be shifted. Well, lifted and shifted, Gemini. So let's see about the Lover's card. Page of Swords. So somebody's watching you. Page of Wands and Ace of Swords. Okay, you're trying to be clear about what you want in love here. Okay, you're trying to be clear with yourself. You're trying to be clear with the universe here. Because you want the message to the universe to go out in a correct fashion. I feel it, it, with the Four of Cups here, there's a disappointment. Like, didn't I put my order in correctly? That's what you're saying. So, hmm. I feel like you get that straight. But it's this energy that needs to be shifted here. And I feel it doesn't have anything to do with the order that you put into the universe. It has everything to do with your energy. Yeah, see? Concern. Okay. So tell me about the Four of Moons. The Two of Wands. The Seven of Swords. And the King of Stars. Some of you are moving. And that's what you're focused on. But you, okay, 
All right, Gemini, if you're moving, the person you're seeking, what you're looking for, is there, and you don't know it. So I feel if you are moving, you're not letting anybody know about this. Tell me about the Seven of Swords, Five of Swords. Oh, that's why. And the Fool. You're not letting anybody know because you don't want any comments from the peanut gallery. You don't want, you, you've got enough to deal with in your mind that you just want to move for whatever reason. Why are you moving? That's what you're wishing for. You're wishing for this move. I don't know if it's the place you're moving to. Oh, for healing. Okay. You feel you can heal better wherever it is you're going. I have no clue where it is, but let's get, yeah, you're making this decision now. I feel like this is, this isn't like right now, this move, but it's very soon. So this is some of the things that you got a lot going on. You, you got a, that's why the seven of wands is here. You've got a lot happening, not only in your mind, but just happening all around you in all aspects of your life. All right. Tell me about the queen of stars. We have the knight of stars, the empress. You can have an earth sign where you're going in the page of stars. There's a lot of earth energy. But I also feel that you're really going to be stable wherever, wherever it is you're going. You're not going to have to worry about your stability. You may be worried. Hmm. You just need to take the leap here with the Fool card. Yep. Your person is there. Your person is there. Could be, um, like I said, an Earth sign or a Libra. But there's a lot of expansion in this union. Tell me about the Knight of Wands. Oh, okay. This is you. All right, so the Sun, the Wanderer, and the World card. So you're off. You're making, you're thinking about this moving forward or physically moving right now. All right, when you do this, you're just going. Like I said, with the Knight of Wands. This is going to make you extremely happy. This has been a dream of yours. Maybe this place has been a dream of yours. And this is going to offer you a brand new beginning, which is going to be very fruitful. Ten of Stars, which is the Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck here. Change was just at the bottom of this deck. Yep, you're, you've got a new community. You're going to have new people around you. You're getting out of this lack mentality. Mm -hmm. You're going to be doing a lot of work wherever you're going. That's going to be very fruitful for you. And you're going to follow your intuition as far as this is concerned, wherever you're moving to. You don't even, you have no idea what's coming. You're following your intuition as far as making this decision and moving on it, but you're going into it blindly. That's what I'm feeling. So tell me about the person that is wherever Gemini is going. Who's this person? Judgment. It's a soulmate. It is a soulmate. It is somebody, yeah, who's vibrationally matched for you. Page of Moons, Ace of Stars. Wow. This is an awesome opportunity, but you're not going to have the opportunity unless you make the decision to do this the energy is here gemini so if you're worried about this don't be worried you got a fresh brand new beginning you've got a clean slate here everything that you want is on the other side of fear that's what i'm getting because the seven of wands can be a bit of fear Paranoia, more paranoia than fear. What are you holding on to? I want to see what you need to let go of. The chariot. Oh, the queen of swords. You're holding on to this dream. Yep, the three of swords. That's why you're going where you're going because you feel like you can heal there. 
the chariot, the queen of swords, you feel like you can be more balanced wherever it is you're going. So you're hanging on to this dream. You're not letting go of it. And you're keeping it to yourself. Whatever you need to do, Gemini. So what is your advice for Gemini? King of Swords, make the decision. That is make the decision because this is what's waiting for you. No? See if this shows up right. The Wheel of Fortune. Okay. So great changes and the Hierophant and great wisdom is waiting for you. But you got to make the decision. And that's what I'm getting from Spirit. Let me get a Kipper here. That's your path. You already know it. Everything you want is on the other side of fear. They're saying it again. All right, so let's get an advice card. Details. Examine your situation and take care of every detail one step at a time. So just do that. And you've got a 32 here, which is change because it's a five, right? So... Gemini, that's what I have for you. Please drop a like below, share, and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading, link is in the description box below. Make sure you utilize that link as there are scammers about the community. And know that you will always see my face in a reading if you order one from me, as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. Have a fabulous day and I will catch you on the flip side on the dailies. Namaste.